Basic Page Layout. Now that your score is complete with all of the notes and markings, you will want to adjust the layout to make it look professional when it is printed. Finale automatically places a final bar line at the end of any score. Once you delete the extra measures at the end of your piece, the final bar line will appear in the last measure. To remove the extra measure at the end of the score, using the selection tool, Double click on the extra measure at the end of the score that you want to delete. This will highlight the measure stack. Press Delete. If you need to delete several measures or a region of measures, double click to highlight the measure stack in the first empty measure. Press Shift and click in the last empty measure. Then press Delete. Make sure you are always in page view when formatting your score. In the Aunt Rhody score, we want four measures on the first system of music and five measures on the second system. If you need to manually move a measure to achieve this score layout, click on the Selection tool. At the end of a music system, click on the measure you wish to move to highlight it. Press the up or down arrow to manually move the measure to the system above or below. The Resize tool is used to reduce or enlarge a staff, music system, or the score for printing. To resize your score for printing, click on the Resize tool, which looks like a percentage sign. Context click in the far upper left corner of the first page and choose Resize Page. For many types of music, some people reduce the score to 90 or 95 percent for printing rather than 100 percent because they like the look of the note and staff size on the page. For large scores with many staves, smaller percentages like 65 to 75 percent must be used in order to get all of the staves on a page. Since this score is only 9 measures, we will leave it set to 100% for printing. 